Hello, welcome back to the next episode of the Tattooed Koei Geezer. This is how I velvet chicken. There's a million different ways. This is such an easy, simple way. It, you know, you've got to use it. Right, I use, because I cook in quantity. So I'm going to use two chicken breasts. Right, this is for two chicken breasts. So you've got your salt, potato starch, little dash of bicarb, MSG, light soy, garlic powder, and a little bit of vegetable oil. That's it. Seriously. Put it in a bowl, mix it. Dice your chicken, fine, thin. Right, just mix everything in together now. All them powders, your soy sauce. You know, there's other versions of this where you can add an egg white. Right, just mix it all in now, make sure every piece of chicken is coated. Right, so we're going to cover that now and put it in the fridge for, um, well, some will say 20 minutes is fine. 20 minutes, half hour. Yeah, go for it. Go for it. I'm going to give it at least an hour, but anything, hour, 24, overnight, whatever. But so long, I'd say minimum 20 minutes, okay? Maximum 24 hours. So there's no real set rule on this, but easy. Cover it, fridge. There you go, geezers. Right. Be back in a bit to chuck that in the frying pan. Check out the next video because that's the chicken I'm going to be using for my Kung Po. Kung Po, Kung Pao. The, um, oh, you're going to have to excuse me, voice. I've just woken up. Oh, and when you spend all night dreaming of velvet and chicken and Kung Pao, you just got to wake up and instantly make it before you sit down put the telly on and do bugger all all day. So yeah, we're gonna be using that for the next video. I just had a rant at myself. <laughs> oh, why bother, let everyone else do it. Right, there we go, quick tidy up. About an hour in the fridge. Start prepping Kung Pao. <laughs> okay, so it's had about an hour. Okay, I'll say about an hour. It's actually about 20 minutes, but I'm hungry. Oh, I'm so hungry, geezers. Right, we're going to wash it now. With cold water. Wash your chicken. Right, that's perfect. That. As soon as the water's clear, you're ready to rumble. So we're going to drain it. And wash your hands. Proper wash your hands. And we obviously washed our hands before we started. Obviously because we haven't got black fingers through doing tarmac all night. <clears throat> um, yeah, but you didn't think you'd be getting a tutorial. Tutorial on how to wash your hands. Ha. It all comes free with me. Right, frying pan, let's do this. Right, I'm going to... Oh, yeah, hold on. Oh, I need a drink. Um, ain't going to need oil, just get your pan up. Love this pan, by the way. 28 centimetre deep frying pan. It is absolutely brilliant. Extremely non-stick, so it's no good for my Indian cooking, but absolutely perfect for this. So, right, just get your pan. Can you see right there? How's that? that better? Yeah, just get your pan hot, hot, hot. It's nice and hot now, so straight in with your chicken. Leave it like that for a minute. Right, look at that, lovely stuff. Now just, I can't do the flippy thing, unless I want chicken all over me kitchen for all that is. Just turn over what you can see. 
Oh yes. And there we have it. A couple of minutes later. Soft, tender, melt in your mouth. <coughs> Chicken. So you can use this now in any dish you want. Oh, I'm going to be doing a Kung Pao. Kung Pao, Kung Pao, as I just mentioned earlier. Which, scroll to my next video, will be that one. Or if you're too quick, then you'll have to wait. <laughs> So I'm going to post this and the Kung Pao will be on in about a couple of hours. I don't even know what the time is now. Is it about 11 o'clock? So give it about 1 o'clock. But yeah, that's done now. So ideal. I've washed my bowl because this is going back in the bowl. There we have it. Beautiful. Over the chicken. Like, like what I do, give me a like, give me a thumbs up, find me on Facebook, find me on Instagram. Drop me a line, I'll try and reply to everything I see. Um, but please subscribe. That's the important bit, geezers. Subscribe. If you like what I do, hit the bell as well. You'll get notifications then for my future videos. Right, there we have it. Time to do some prep now for the next one. Take the Koei, geezer. Out.